It takes courage to turn your back on the shore of luring promise, the safe land of strain and sacrifice leading you astray on an empty quest. I have lived on that land of strain and sacrifice. When you do something for a long time, even if it's hard, you get comfortable there. I've worked as a caregiver all of my adult life. The last 23 or so years of that have been on the graveyard shift. I've always loved my job. I found purpose there caring for others. After all, witches are healers. Don't get me wrong, it's hard work. Some of the hardest, both physically and emotionally. But it's a job that's always come easily for me. I've always thought I would do this job until the day I retire. I only have eight more years. Surely I can handle eight more years. And then came the pandemic. And suddenly eight more years sounds like a lifetime. Eight more years feels like an eternity. This year, my husband and I have talked a lot about what we want our lives to look like after he retires next July. And me coming home from work every morning tearful does not fit into that picture. As we got closer to summer and all those memories of last fall and winter came crashing down on me, all of those wounds of 2020 that I've been desperately trying to heal started to reopen as another surge put us in outbreak status yet again. The job that used to make me feel proud, fulfilled, and happy now just makes me feel anxious and weary and sad. I have nothing left to give. My once overflowing cup is now empty, leaving not even a drop for myself. All that is left on my saucer is a cup full of pain and shame and guilt and feelings of inadequacy and failure to live out my life's purpose. This feeling will wane in time as I begin to refill my cup. It takes courage to turn your back on the shore of luring promise, the safe land of strain and sacrifice leading you astray on an empty quest. But that place that you seek is a sea of delight and only a joyful heart will make port in that haven of happiness. That haven of happiness, that's where I want to spend my days and my nights. That's where I want to live. I never thought my wellness journey would lead me here. I am at a crossroad. I could stay on this path or venture in a new direction. And I am up for a venture in a new direction. I choose happiness and I will choose it every time. This whole year has been a spell, a spell to be well. I've lit the candles, burned the parchment. I've screamed prayers of healing and hope into the night sky, sang beautiful words of gratitude and love as an offering to the great all that is cried oceans of tears at my witch mother's feet as she straightens my crown and dresses me in a suit of armor. Courage. That is what witchcraft has given me. The courage to take chances, to leap into the great unknown. When you cast for a new opportunity, not really knowing what that will look like, and that new opportunity takes form of a new job opening in your home, away from home, you have to have the courage to seize the moment. Manifest the life I desire. My spell to be well. My God, I love magic. I only have three more night shifts before I start my new job. 
all my days will be days and all my nights will be nights. And what is my purpose now when I'm no longer serving what I thought was my life's purpose? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what I do. I don't have to look for life's purpose because there is purpose in my presence. There is purpose in spending time with my husband. There is purpose in sleeping in the dark every night. There is purpose in my art, in discovering new things, purpose in living. My presence here in this life is all the purpose I need. I am an artist. I have been given a fresh canvas and in my hand, I hold the brush. What I decide to paint is up to me. There is freedom waiting for you on the breezes of the sky. And you ask, what if I fall? Oh, but my darling. Oh, but my darling. What if you fly? I am so excited to start this new phase. I am so excited to start this new phase of my life. I found the freedom. I found the freedom to take that journey to the haven of happiness on the breezes of the sky. Watch me soar. Strive to be happy. Life keeps spinning, no one's winning. Are we ever gonna stop? Pretending that there's no ending, there's no mending. When is this bubble gonna pop? I'm sorry, but our time is out. Whatever we had is long overdue. I know we've had our doubts, and I had no clue what to do. It's an emergency. I gotta break free to find me. I have no clue